Okay, so here we are, back at my flying field. Swan's over there. And less wind than yesterday. Bit of a gloomy overcast day, as you can see. Well, second flight is gonna be with this battery. It's a three cell, 2900 mAh battery. Um, 36C, 35C constant burst and 65 um, when you need it. And it's gonna go onto this five inch quad. So let's see how we get on. Okay, so a reasonably steady three minute flight with the Overlander 2900 three cell. Um, about a three minute flight, came up with 68% uh, battery left. So obviously I wasn't really thrashing it and the voltage did drop considerably. I can't show it because I don't have the telemetry in the goggles uh, that I can record. Um, but it was going down to 10 volt and I backed it off and, and it went back up to over 11. So with that, three minutes and 68% left. Okay, so here's the Zippy Compact 2200. Again, about a three minute, three minute 30 second flight. I can check that on the camera when I, you know, when I get back. Uh, we're down to 54%. And again, no GoPro or anything on there, just as it is. And, and that battery weighs 186 gram. Um, the one I just used for the first flight, the Overlander, uh, that one weighs 184 grams. So they're about the same, just a different, um, output okay third flight this morning is going to be with this quite old Turnergy 2.2 it's a, a four cell battery and it weighs 257 grams so it's considerably more um, than the last two the flight one was 184 gram flight two was 186 gram where are they there we go 184 186 and this one 257 so let's get it in the air and see how we get on with this one on a three minute flight okay so here we have uh, just after the flight with the Turnergy 2.2 it's quite an old one uh, I was given this probably a year ago um, so certainly not new by any means. Um, and we're down to 36% after approximately a three minute flight. I forgot to set the timer. So I'll have to check the video on the quad just to see what that was. Um, about three minutes and 36%. Did a few more, a few more stunts, a few rolls and flips, that, but not much. Let's see how we get on. Okay, so the Zippy Compact 3300. Uh, which weighs an incredible 341 gram on approximately a three minute flight um, from fully charged uh, is down to 32% and that's pretty much where I like to keep my batteries around about 30% certainly on my camera drones they come in at 30% um, but that is one heavy battery to be to be to be lifted um, <coughs> so <laughs> I, think, I think the drone is is about the same weight to be honest same weight as that battery okay let's try another one Okay, here is the little uh, Turnergy Nano, uh, Nanotech, uh, 149 gram, and we've had about three minutes, and I put the GoPro on it compared to yesterday when I didn't, and we're down to 2%. That has surprised me immensely. Um, the battery is certainly warm to the touch. It's, it's cooled down over the last 20 seconds or so since taking it out. Um, not hot, but certainly quite warm. Um, and... I put this on here and got some got some footage with a little camera. I hope it worked. Uh, now, the, oddly, when I came in to, to land, I noticed that the camera wasn't recording. Now, I'm wondering if if because it was such a low voltage, it's, it's it stopped that recording. I don't know. I'm not sure. Um, but this flight, I don't think there's any, any footage on that. As things stand, when I get home on the computer, I might be wrong. But 2%, that's... that's shocked and surprised me to be honest and um, so <laughs> i won't be doing that again uh, or if i do it'll be like a two minute flight something like that if i've got if i've got this on anyway okay and that's that for this one okay possibly the last flight of today um this morning anyway is again using another zippy compact 2200 weighing 186 gram and this time i've got the little mount on the front with me uh, 
the Casso camera in there and let's see how we get on. I've only set the timer this time for I think two and a half minutes um, but it'll be a gentle flight, I won't be throwing it around and just more for cin cinematography just to see how we get on with it. Okay, let's come back when it's done. Okay, so here we had the Zippy Compact 2200 uh, weighing 186 gram. Uh, the identical one there, 186 gram. And this time we had on this little uh, 4K camera uh, onto the drone. And I reckon I did round about three minutes ish flight. I'd have to check again on the camera. Uh, and let's see, let's see what we get to. Let's just pop that, pop that there for a minute. Let's see what uh, what it said. It says, okay, can we see that? Uh, so about three minutes, we're down to 45% power, and it's about a three minute flight, and that's with a 2200 battery. Right, okay, so that actually worked out better than one of the larger batteries, I believe. Certainly, I think, better than the, the largest battery. But what we'll do is we'll get all this information collated when we get back uh, and I'll do a quick review on these particular batteries. Thanks for watching. Okay so that was the last battery, uh, Zippy Compact 2200, three cell, um, two and a half minutes of flight, <laughs> um, coming to a very abrupt end in the field um, just in front of me. Uh, I think I tried a, a roll or a, or a flip or something, I was too low. So anyway, no damage. A little bit of pride, perhaps, but uh, a bit of bit of mud on the uh, propeller, but that's that's all. So other than that, unscathed. So again, a successful return to home in an unfashionable fashion. So that's it. So 66 percent, uh, two and a half minutes, zipping around pretty rapidly. So uh, brilliant. Let's get back and collate these results. Let me take you for a ride Dancing with the lights Our hearts beating like a drum
Okay. 